Hey Jim, you up? Two men will be working in the fields together. One will be taken and the other left. Two women will be going about their household tasks. One will be taken and the other left. So prepare yourselves for your Lord is coming and any minute, any second could be the last chance to give yourself to Christ. Dude, Jesus Christ, will you cool it? Do my bad. Okay, I'll stop. All right. Because when he returns, it will happen that fast. As the Bible says in the twinkling of an eye, millions of people will suddenly disappear and leave this earth to meet their Lord. And a shocked world will discover that the Bible said was true, and this is not a fairy tale. It will happen. So friends, if you haven't given yourself to Christ, do it now, because a rapture will come and Christ will return. As it says in the Bible, he will come as a thief in the night. Hey, what the hell was that? Dude, that's the name of the movie. Now, now it's time for the song. Oh, right. Hit it. The sermon was pretty interesting, huh? I thought it was pretty interesting. What? You guys for real? You guys believe all that mumbo jumbo? Well, I believe it. I'm a Christian. No, you're not. Well, I mean, I go to church, you know, just about every Sunday. I'm just not as into it as Wayne and those guys. <laughs> those guys are crazy. Hey, I think those guys are cool. Are you being for real right now? Yeah. In fact, I'm going to go talk to Wayne right now. What? Did that... Did she... Did that just happen? Love it. <laughs> is she really going to hang out with Wayne? I can't stand that guy. <laughs> People hang out with him? Jesus. I'm glad you decided to talk to me today, Jenny. Well, I was thinking about your sermon last night, and you were talking about God and the Bible, and I just wanted to know more. Well, I'm thrilled. What would you like to know? I wanted to know how you let God into your heart. Well, you pray. That's it? That's it. You just have to believe. I think I believe, but I've never prayed before. Well, I could show you right now. Would you like me to pray for you? That would be great. Let's bow our heads. Dear Heavenly Father who has blessed us with life. What's up, Jenny Magdalene? Shut up, Damien. <laughs> that wasn't very Christian, was it? At least I believe in something. What do you believe in? I believe in so much. I believe in the Packers Whatever. this year. Hey, hey, what are you doing? Yeah. Hey, what's up, what's guys? Up? What's going on? Wayne was going to tell us a little bit more about the Lord. Oh, that sounds so entertaining. Oh, come on. Give the guy a chance. <laughs> okay. But only because you asked and because he's so enthusiastic about it. Go ahead, Wayne. All right. Well, you see, in the end of times, after God saves us, 
Those who are left behind on earth will be stuck in a time of tribulation. They will be forced to receive the mark of the beast in order to purchase goods. Those who wish to accept the Lord will have to avoid receiving the mark and trust that God will save them, and they will be viewed as outcasts. But how will they buy food? They'll have to trust that God will provide for them. Speaking of food, is anybody else hungry? Oh, Jim. <laughs> <laughs> I hate you guys so much. So much. And just about a minute into the first quarter. Jim? 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 Jim, wake up! Jim! Oh. oh, thank God you're okay. Yeah, I think I'm fine. What What happened? I was attacked, and then I blacked out. But that's when I saw him. What do you mean you saw him? God. You saw God? Well, I didn't really see him, it was just a really bright light. But then he talked to me. What did he say? He said if I believed that I'd be saved. And now here I am. That's unbelievable. Well, it's true, man. And he also told me to tell you that I ate your Thanksgiving leftovers. I'm sorry, man. And I hope you haven't used your toothbrush today. Why? No reason. Oh, hey, Patrick. How's it going, friend? What's going on, Wayne? Oh, just enjoying another beautiful day in all of God's creatures. <laughs> no offense, but God's like the last thing I want to think about right now. You still hung up on Jim converting to Christianity? Yeah, I mean, I guess I just wasn't ready to lose my best friend. People let me tell you about my best friend. He's a warm-hearted person who loved me till the end. People let me tell you about my best friend. Lose him? From what I heard, it sounds like God saved your friend. Yeah, I know he believes that. And you don't? Well, I don't really know what to believe anymore. Well, whatever you decide to believe in, remember this. Jim is your friend no matter what your faith is. I don't know. I just, I just wish things could go back to the way they used to be. Well, just think about all the good times you had with Jim. Don't let the small changes affect the way you feel about him. Hey, Patrick. Yeah? Jesus, man. Suck. Suck. Ah, oh, you suck. Oh, oh, what is- Oh, you got me. You got me again. Mm, what you say mm, that you only meant well when well, cause you did Huh, Jesus did that? Mm, what you say mm, that you only meant well when well, I got it, I got it. Oh, oh, I'm open! I'm open! Mm, what you say that you only meant when mm, What you say mm, That you only meant when mm, What you say Hey Jim, you up?
Jim? Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, as I speak to you tonight, my words are translated to every major Tongan dialect in the world, except for French. They're on their own. Excluding France, the remaining nine world powers have come together to consolidate and have a committee run imperialistic power to run the world during this state of emergency. The World Council would like to ensure citizens that we do not wish to hinder your rights at all, but it is a necessity that all citizens show their support for UNITE by receiving an approved UNITE identifier. The nine ruling nations have chosen the number 999 as means of identification which represents the nine nations coupled together with the three honorable traits we stand by, peace, love, and unity. Solid. What's up, man? You want a break? No, man. It's cool. You can break. Okay, thanks, man. I got it. Watch this. So, uh... How's Russell Wilson doing this season? Yeah, he's all right. He's doing all right this season. Not as good as I want him to, but you know, you can't really ask too much from Seattle, you know what I'm saying? Hey man, what'd I make? Solid. Solid. Uh, dude, what's that on your, on your uh, arm right there? Oh, this? Oh, this is my 999 tattoo. You know, the one that everybody's getting? It's a cool thing to do, bro. Look at it. Look at it. It's fresh. Wow, 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 wow. Fresh as can be, dude, look at that. Boom. Chicks dig it, man. No, dude, those are definitely sixes. I mean, I know what a six looks like, and that's a six. Yeah, why would you put three nines in a row? No, I don't care if it looks fresh. It's not fresh. Chicks don't dig it. Those are sixes. Okay, look, look at this. I'm gonna show you real quick. No, man, dude, that's nine. These are straight nines. Look at that, nine, nine, nine. Come on, bro, look at it. Are you looking at this? Look at it! Okay, right there. Boom, nine. Now it's uh Yeah dude, I know what that is. It's an upside down nine, okay. Oh shit. Hello? Please Damien, you have to help me. I haven't eaten in days. I'm so hungry. I can't go anywhere. I can't buy anything without the mark. I'm afraid they're gonna find me. Aw, oh, don't be silly, dude. They're just trying to help. That's not what I've heard. Well, what'd you hear? I've heard about people getting caught without the mark. I've heard... I've heard they'll kill you. Patrick, that's outrageous. Damien, you have to help me. Well, fine. Where, where, where are you at? It's me, Damien, my bad. <gasps> please, no! <laughs> please, no! No, please! <laughs> no! No!
Dude, Jim, I just had the craziest dream. Jim? Jim? Check one, two, check, check, one, two, check, 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 okay, let's hear that. <laughs>